My name's Albert Owens. I'm the Memorial Custodian at Palace Barracks in Hollywood, and I have been for the last 22 years. It's there to remember all the guys and the girls who've lost their lives while serving in the UK Armed Forces for the last 50 years. Because I've always dreamt that the Palace Barracks Memorial Garden is there for one reason and one reason alone. Out of all the conflicts it covers, it's to let people know that we haven't forgot the loved ones and they'll always be remembered with honour and pride. Recently I've just started uh, doing a book on, on those killed in Afghanistan. As you know there's been 453 men and women killed there and I just thought it would be a good idea if we could do something that's never been done before in remembrance of, the, of them and the families, that the families would have something to, to look at. And I decided to come across with this book um, with photographs of every serviceman and woman that's been killed in Afghanistan. I've been working on the book about, about 11 months. That's from getting the first idea, going round certain people, uh, getting advice, a uh, lot of phone calls, uh, and then we finally came to a decision, or I came to a decision, that I was going to go ahead with this. I was selling the book basically uh, uh, to make money for those charities that sometimes don't get all the help they deserve. Um, so I picked certain charities like the Army Benevolent Fund, uh, SAFA Forces Help, and SAFA Forces Help bereaved families as well as the, the RAF Benevolent Fund. So it's some charities that uh, I find that need the help. And the other good thing is that we couldn't find a charity for the Royal Navy. So what we've picked is we've picked a Royal Marine charity called Go Commando. So they're all going to get help from the sale of this book. And it's a collector's item because it's never been done before. If you want to purchase the book, we've got a simple way of doing it. You go on the website, which is www palacebarracksmemorialgarden.co.uk you'll see a picture of the book come on the screen and you just follow the instructions the project's been a, a labour of love for myself because basically what I want to achieve is, is twofold one is that these young men and women who've lost their lives in Afghanistan are never ever forgotten for the sacrifice they've made we're also making some good come of it because the money raised will go to help those soldiers and families that have either been injured or have other problems because of the loss of a loved one. And that means more to me than anything else.